guys, welcome to the show. So, இன்னைக்கு நம்ம ஷோவில் அ பியூட்டிஃபுல் காஜியஸ் மாடல் இருக்காங்க யார் அப்படின்னு பார்த்தீங்க அப்படின்னா சைஃபாஸ் வின்னா வி ஹாவ் தி அப்ராஜிதா மாடல் அண்ட் அவங்கக்கிட்ட வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு ஸ்பீக் அ லாட் ஆஃப் திங்ஸ் அண்ட் அவங்களுக்கு வந்து தமிழ் தெரியல அப்படின்னு சொல்லியிருக்காங்க பட் இந்த இன்ட்ராக்ஷன் எந்த அளவுக்கு இருக்க போகுது அப்படிங்கிறத நீங்களே பார்த்து தெரிஞ்சுக்க போகிறீங்க வாங்க Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm good. So, uh, I, I was heard that you, you don't know Tamil much. Yes, I'm talking about Tamil. Wow, nice. <laughs> Tamil is what you know about Tamil. I know a little bit. A little bit. A little bit. Pace now you can understand, right? Yes. Okay. So, <clears throat> Englicu, you are looking so absolutely, you are looking very gorgeous today. Mm-hmm. And with that crown, with some uh, blue and uh, diamond color stones are... very beautiful for you thank you so much so how time. long it your journey has been you're looking gorgeous interview. as well thank you so much <laughs> thank you that's so sweet of you and i love your energy <laughs> thank you <laughs> so nariya compliments um kuduthirukanga it is so nice and let me know your journey in this modeling industry okay so i started my modeling before 3 years and uh, i've done work in mumbai surat chandigarh so different different cities lay work panni terke ha then i came here in chennai and <coughs> that's how oh. my journey okay that's nice in chennai yeah. okay so when when we get the words haifa now now i i i i think so the people can uh, remember only the name called aprajita In, uh, when we remember like Saifa, obvious அப்ராஜிதா அவங்களோட நேம் தான் ஞாபகம் வரும் நினைக்கிறேன் போக போக மாடலிங் இண்டஸ்ட்ரி அப்படின்னு சொன்னாலே you have to maintain your yeah. body your skin and everything day by day yeah so how conscious you are about it i am very conscious uh, it's been 3 years i'm off sugar mm. and i am not eating any of fried food okay. yeah and no maida no maida at all <laughs> no junk food okay please list out the food items what do you follow in a day okay so um in my diet i use green veggies okay. uh, mostly i prefer and for protein source i use uh, milk dairy products okay yeah and soya as well soya beans and all so whatever the products like rich in protein i use that and for carbs and all like uh, we are already taking like rice yeah. and yeah so fibers and all so you uh, you are cutting down rice or else you take some alternative no, no, i food. take i take a uh, little bit of rice yeah. you need at that yeah. you know so you are like same like me i hope so <laughs> so some people feel like, like they needed the foods which are all always needed i think so yeah. okay mm. no because we already like uh, we had cut off uh, all the junk foods and all so we need little bit carbs as well in our body so for that like we have to take okay yeah fiber and <laughs> okay so before that how much pageant shows have you been so far uh this was my first beauty pageant oh so yeah. in the first time you have won the winner yeah. right it's absolutely it's so sweet to hear that and what are the things you face or uh, face something it is difficult it's not comfortable or you, you might have felt no uh like yeah earlier i was having a little bit of like uh, this fear inside me like i can i'm not a beauty pageant person and uh, before that even i choreographed to beauty pageant but <laughs> <laughs> never thought of participating but this time once i got to know about sai farm in south india so i thought okay let's give it a try and <laughs> to overcome this fear and uh, see uh, here i'm <laughs> yes it's so am, nice so. <laughs> and here we are talking about it and i needed to ask like uh, sai fi it's a very kind different kind of uh, thing yeah. comparatively to other agencies yeah exactly so sci- what do you have learned from that okay uh, so uh, sai fi if i talk about sai fi you know uh, they are extremely genuine in this uh, i found them very genuine uh, agency and um, 
association like uh, i the time i got association with saifa like i was so happy <laughs> because you know they never ask for uh, many people if they go for uh, normal uh, shows and all they always seek for the money from yeah, yeah from how to get the money and all, yeah. Yeah. but saifa is not at all you know they always give equal opportunity to uh, all the people who are working in this modeling industry where uh, they are photographers they are models so they, it's really nice working with them so how did you uh, know about saifa somebody referred you or else? yeah the, the they were organizing the show uh, miss south india and i got to know about this event um, through my friend okay so he recommended me for that yeah uh-huh. Okay, <clears throat> so when you got that idea, because you told me that you were actually relating mm-hmm. the people of some pageants, and at last you also came to the pageant yeah. show. So when you got that idea, like uh, I have to be a model, who to whom you confessed it first? To myself. To because, yourself. Oh, yeah, nice. That time I was pursuing my engineering. Ah. So uh, I thought, okay, okay, like uh, if I want to do something, uh. Okay, I was I was not very studious, but I was every student in my college time, and I was always included in like extracurricular activities and all. But uh, the time I got to know, okay, no, this is the thing I really want to do in my life. I <laughs> so uh, that thing like I decided, okay, so you have to Aparajita, you <laughs> meant for this, and you have to do this. So I was the only person like I confronted <laughs> this thing to me, and. Uh, After that, like I started my uh, modeling journey. Okay, so yeah. you look like a queen with this crown. Thank you and so much. if you want to say a few words to share about the people or the youngsters who mm-hmm. wanted to become a model, what will be the simple piece of advice you would give? Yeah, be bold enough to choose mm. your own path. I know you're gonna get like lot of hurdles in your life because sometimes you know uh, family also, uh, including that you know yes. f- uh, some someone's family they don't allow to go in this field because many people like ha- like you know they concern about this field because there are some obviously dark side as well of yeah. this industry. So uh, parents are very conscious about like if someone is doing something in this field, so they don't allow anybody. So no, if you really want to do like there are some good people as well. So just be bold enough to choose your own path and uh, to take your own decision. Okay, so, so yeah. that's so sweet of you. And uh, what are your next plans to go ahead? Okay, so um, I'm already an actor and uh, I, I'm already. challenges இருக்கும் as a model abdin paakum bodu there is some uh, challenges and the, sometimes the model feel some insecurities uh, while doing modeling so nariya irukku like neenga sonna mari nariya agencies la like or fresher ah irukanga abdina nariya per emattra padranga i mean the the people get been cheated so apdi la irukkum bodu what do you feel yeah the there are some obviously i told you there is a dark side of uh, this as well like <laughs> so if you are stepping in something you have to be very careful like whom you are choosing and uh, whom you are going to work with so you have to be very, very careful and uh, the time i came here i had no idea about the people whoever is working in this and it's like which agency is good which agency is not so i also face these issues like if you are you know uh, if you are staying in some new places and exploring that place obviously everybody face these kind of issues but uh, you learn mm. <laughs> throughout the journey like you learn and you grow so you have to keep on walking on so you shouldn't stop okay the thing uh, have you heard say. like uh, people have told about something uh, which is which makes you frightened in this kind of field either the catering king la person no i was i was never scared i was never scared because i knew already like i am very bold mm. <laughs> so whatever uh, whatever the consequences will be like i'm ready for that i'm ready to face the challenges so so the main issue we were speaking about issues which were commonly mm-hmm. uh, 
being faced by a model but romba detail la nam or sila vishayangal paakumbodhu there are so much of models being harassed or some other stuffs are happening so yeah. and the madri vishayangala neenga eppadi paakringa ha the main issue is you know uh, you already heard of casting couch and all yeah. and these things already happening in the industry and uh, you know the some talented people like they go to do something in this they really aspire to do something in this field but for somehow <coughs> and for some reason they didn't get chance uh, to you know uh, to perform well to yeah. do because they didn't they literally don't get the opportunity to prove their self because the people who whoever is doing all these stuff uh, to make them make themselves like you know uh, take on the little higher level and uh, Yeah. they go beyond each and everything like they do each and everything to get that whatever they yeah. desire yeah so whatever the desire is just to fulfill their desire in the name of you know fulfilling the desire to do each and everything and uh, i shouldn't say these things on like you know <laughs> on, on the camera, channel but yeah. still uh, there are some drawback as well and there are some dark side of this field as well even i yeah i have already told you like i choreographed two shows and um, in the one show like even i faced that issue you know i was choreographing but i was feeling bad at the same time because we already uh, okay. you know uh, <laughs> they have already fixed the winner i i cannot name that uh, pageant okay but yeah so i felt really bad ki as a trainer obviously i I'll, I'll, like there there were some people there were some girls like they were doing really well still it was all fixed mm. but uh, saifa you know uh, working with saifa is so amazing because they are really genuine <coughs> they always like uh, you know they give the opportunity to all the kind of people yeah. they don't differentiate between people and they don't value these things like whatever yeah whoever is talented they always give the chance to them so that's so, so nice yeah. but you told me regarding that uh, as an a pageant you you were not uh, reaching up to the level and mm-hmm. the thing you didn't get what you have expected right you just told yeah. me now yeah, yeah yeah so at the time uh, whether the people around you or yourself have been forced to do to do something no 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 not to me but like i've seen them forcing someone else okay because that time i was not included in pageant and all like i was choreographing but i was not into this but before that like nobody like has ever asked me for this and yeah in modeling obviously i faced this issue like uh, lord, that's what yeah in modeling like lot of people like uh, for these ki okay uh, this things like already like you know adjustment compromise they use these kind of words okay ki, uh, yeah for project and all so okay <clears throat> so i hope uh, in tamil industry is there something facing like that or do you heard about it's something it's everywhere happening? you cannot everywhere. say <laughs> you cannot say uh, there or here it's everywhere so uh, but you know you uh, there is a little yang in ying so <laughs> it's a completely a concept of yin yang ki, okay uh, there will be little black in whole white and there will be little white in black so. yes So yeah. everywhere there is a white and black thing yeah, so it exactly. happens everywhere yeah okay so we wish you all a grand success Thank ahead so and we wanted to and of course as you said kadalika neeramale padathile ungalukaga naanga ellarume poi paapom okay okay so much thank you